So let's just drop in a couple of images to fill the background of the uh, the cover jacket in here um, and uh, make sure that the images layer is active in the layers panel and then I'll go to file and I'll choose place. So we're going to pick, um, we've got an advert first. Um, notice these are .psd, so these are Photoshop documents. I then need to uh, click on the cover 01 as well, which is uh, even more important. This one is a PSD because this involves a technique where the part of the per person here is going to be cutting into the design that's on the page. And in order to do that, we have to create what's called a layer mask in Photoshop. I will cover that at the end of these videos if you're interested in the technique. We do need to make sure that showing part options is turned on. Click on open. So the first one inside of here, what I need to do is I need to turn off the layer called Lady. And then um, I need to, in this case, click OK. And the other image, that's all good. I can just click OK to that one. So let's start with the easy one first. I'm going to tap the right cursor key to pick the uh, add first. Hover my cursor at the top left hand side of the bleed and then left click to drop that in. Uh, at the size that we need there thereabouts and then with this one again i'm going to hover my cursor up here and then left click and let go of the mouse so let's just look at the just move this to the side uh pick this image this runs out to the bleed just move this so it just goes to there so we're running that right down the middle of the spine that's all good now we can probably lock this now so if I've got it selected, I can go to object and then choose lock and then go back to this one and drag this on here so that it fits right out to the bleed on the edges in here, going down, right down to the bottom. Um, so we need to just scale that up a little bit in there. So I'm going to go to the auto fit and then just scale it up a touch like so, just to make sure it fits in there and then click and hold down the mouse and pull. Oh, now, wait a minute. I need to turn off auto fit first and then pull this handle in here over just to the bleed line in there like so. So that's uh, that's all working well. Um, and now that obviously, it looks like we've got the whole image in there. We, we have, but I've got another version of this photograph with just the lady on. So this, what we're seeing here is it's a composition of the woman and the background, but we've also got an additional layer which contains just the lady on. That's going to give us the way that we can cut the lady and her hair into different bits that are on the page in there. So I have covered this technique in the other magazines as well, such as 442, but I will go through this specific file afterwards and show you how that's done. 